Yo, what is going on guys? We are back today for an extremely special video. Season 20 of Alliance War has just ended. It is currently four in the morning for me right now. I stayed up all night waiting for this, the official results and for the rewards to go out. And as you can see for Loki, number three on the leaderboard, man. This is so cool. I've never placed this high in Alliance War before. Um, and it's, it feels it feels so great and uh, the rewards also feel pretty great We got a lot of stuff to open here, um, and I still also have this uh, T5CC selector from uh, the boss uh, Summer Smackdown correction boss rush thing so we're gonna open up that afterwards Hopefully we can form some tier 5 catalysts, but before we get into the crystal opening first a quick word from today's video sponsor Raid Shadow Legends Want to be part of the largest community in mobile gaming? Come check out Raid Shadow Legends. I've been playing Raid for about 8 months and one of the things that keeps me playing is just the massive community. In the Discord there's over 100,000 members, there's thousands of videos being posted about the game every single week. The Reddit has over 40,000 members and this is one of the reasons why starting the game is so easy just because of how helpful the community is and how many resources there are. Raid has over 25 million downloads with over 1 million people playing the game and logging in every single day. There's also been over 200,000 clans created. There are nearly 1,000 videos uploaded to YouTube every single week about Raid and you can use these videos and resources to help you figure out how to beat certain bosses, which champions to rank up, and really help you progress throughout the game. My personal favorite thing in Raid Shadow Legends is the ability to ascend characters and upgrade their star level because you can start the game with any champion at any star level and eventually you can get them to the highest star level, which I really like. So what's new this month for September 2020 for Raid? Well, they just released a massive champion update, tweaking and rebalancing over 20 different champions to make player versus player arena battles even more competitive. If that's not enough, the Forge just came out, so now you can save time and start crafting top quality artifacts and competing right away. So if you'd like to support me and give Raid a try, go to the video description, click on the special links, and if you're a new player, you will receive 50,000 silver, 50 gems, one energy refill, one clan boss key, five mystery shards, one day XP booster, and one free champion, the Executioner, who's going to help you get through a lot of the early contents. Very good champion. All this treasure will be waiting for you here. Good luck, and I'll see you there. All right, guys, let's open some crystals, man. So 35,000 six star shards, 50,000 five star shards, a 25% T5CC crystal, I want to say selector. This is huge. If I can get the right class out of this, ooh, that's going to be big. And a couple of T5 basics, which is always nice. So let's go ahead and claim those. Such fat rewards. And uh, let's go open some stuff, man. So... We got, we got a few crystals to open. We got a, a five star awakening gem here first. This was from the side event. Uh, and I have three of one class of these. So anything but that class would be good. And okay, good. That's not the class. I didn't want to say it. Just, I didn't want to jinx it. It was cosmic. I have three cosmic awakening gems. So skill, don't have any of those. That's good. Uh, let's see, what else do we have to open over here? We'll, we'll do T5CC last. I, I don't know what I'm going to pick for my selector yet. Um, all right, let's jump over here. I have a featured five star. This was also from the side event. Um, it, this side event is so good, man. Honestly, like even the, the second highest difficulty one, I've been taking a lot of key, tier three keys for that one because there's so much good stuff in there. Even some better stuff than the, the tier four one. Um, like this featured five star crystal, for example, that's 15,000 shards worth. Like, that's so worth it. And let's see, we're landing on Black Widow. That's really good. And we just got a skill awakening gem. Uh, she might be going to rank five. That's awesome, man. That's really awesome. All right, great start to this opening. Uh, take a little screenshot of that sent to my alliance mate. He's a big fan of her. All right, and now I'm going to be saving my five star shards. For maybe the next featured or for a bunch of tech crystals haven't decided quite yet um, but it's time for the six star shards man so we're gonna start with a featured i i'm tempted to just go for three featureds but i'm honestly not sure yet so we're gonna start with one we're gonna open it and we're gonna see what we get we're gonna see what we get here 
Now there's two champions specifically that I really, really want out of here. And that's the Canadian boy. Um, I'm sure you guys know who I'm talking about. Uh, I think he's the coolest looking character in the game. And then also someone who recently got a major buff who is just really ridiculous. He stacks prowess. He uh, lowers metal champion's ability accuracy. He's pretty good. So yeah, one of those two champions would be amazing. So yeah, that's what we're looking for. Let's go ahead, tap this crystal, but come on, man. Ah, oh, so close to Guardian. Gwenpool, that's interesting. I'm really glad that that wasn't Hitmonkey, actually. I uh, would have been kind of disappointed if that was Hitmonkey. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling basics, man. I don't know. I just, I'm not feeling the features. I don't know. Uh, let's see, how many... Yeah, 12,000 left. All right, yeah, we'll go. We'll, we're just going to go through basics, man. I, I don't know. I, I'm tempted to go featured. I had, that's, this is the most, I'm maximizing my shards here. Four crystals, one featured. I, I don't know, man. It's, it's, oh, there's only like, there's only two champions that I want in that, in that pool. So it's, it's really tough. I can't, I can't. There's so many champions in the basic that I want, and that would be so good. Uh, I opened up a bunch of crystals on the beta. I didn't record it or anything. I posted the screenshot on Twitter, and oh, it! I felt instant regret after opening. I got Nick Fury, I got Ghost, I got Void, all as six stars, man. And I'm just like, why couldn't that have been on the main server, you know? So, let's see. Uh, Symbiote Spider Man. I'm, I'm glad that didn't roll over to the Joe Fix It. Uh, at least it's new. Uh, I would love for Symbiote Spider Man to get a buff, dude. I th Symbiote Spider Man is like my favorite variation of Spider Man, aside from uh, Peter Parker with the Carnage suit. Uh, like, that's always my favorite arc in Spider Man TV shows or movies when he gets the Symbiote. I, I don't know, I just love it. And he looks so cool in this game. I just wish he was better. I'd love for him to get a buff, man. Really love it. Um, but yeah, all right, next crystal here. Let's tap it. Oh, maybe I should've went featured. <laughs> Nick Fury. Oh man. Winter Soldier, a dupe. At least it wasn't Angela. Angela would have been, I think it would have taken her to SIG 100. So thank God. Uh, all right, I'm, I'm gonna back out and then jump back in here, dude. Come on, this is number three in Alliance War. Can you, can you please make this <laughs> worth all that effort, man? So much effort, so many boosts, so many mastery changes, so many units, so much stress. Uh, Come on, make make the season worth it. Give me give me a champion that I'm after. One of the five that I'm looking for: Magneto, Doctor Doom, Nick Fury, Warlock. Give me one of those. It's a Sig forty. That's a Sig forty. Got that on the beta too. Of course, that's that's the beta pull that transfers over to the live server. Ah, okay. That's horrible. Maybe I, I should have went featured, man. I, basic pool is so garbage. Wow. Okay. I'm not mad yet. Uh, because that doesn't matter. Those shards, I'll get more shards, whatever. What, what I really care about right now is Catalyst of the Tier 5 class variety so here we can take a look at what i'm working with now as you can see i have zeros in f four classes and in three of those classes this class this class 
and this class. I'm not even going to say any class names because the game's always listening, it seems. I have not formed a single catalyst in this class or this class. And I haven't formed a catalyst in this class, but I pulled a full one. But any one of those three classes would be phenomenal. One specifically to uh, rank up my favorite champion. So we got some T5CC crystals to open today, man. And depending what we get out of here, I can claim my selector. Now this 25% one matters the most, more than any of them. Because if we can get one of those three classes, we can form a catalyst today, and that could be a rank three tomorrow. This is the crystal. This was the reason why I really wanted to get rank three for the season, because if we just got masters, we'd get two 10% crystals. But I really wanted this. Please, please. Dude, unfreaking believable. The the only class that I really didn't want. Are you kidding me? It's unfathomable. It really is, dude. I'm on my way to forming my fourth cosmic catalyst. Why? The one goddamn class that I didn't want, dude. This game. <laughs> I don't understand. All I get is freaking cosmic, man. I'm gonna rank three Thanos, dude. I'm gonna do it. Like, oh look at that, more more cosmic. That's great. Oh my god, dude. This game, it, it just, <laughs> it, it's listening. It knows exactly what you want and what you don't want. It's, it's unbelievable, Un unbelievable. Tech, that's good. That's good. Thank you for not giving me stupid cosmic. But again, naughty. I'm. <laughs> I just want to form a science catalyst. Now that I've opened them, I'll say the class name, and I, I can't form a goddamn science catalyst to rank up my human torch, man. So we're gonna take this, claim it, and we're gonna take science. Cause I've already used my selector from Act Six, the twenty-five percent selector from Act Six. I pick science from that to get these fragments. It's so hard to form one catalyst that I want, Matt. It's, it's ridiculous. After all that, I'm still not there. I'm still so far away. <laughs> wow, wow, th wow, this opening did not go my way at all. Uh, no new champions that I want to rank up. Uh, two new ones, uh, Cosmic Spider-Man and Gwenpool, who are not going to be used a single time outside of Arena. More SIGs on Jane Foster, and Awaken Winter Soldier. I was so excited for this, and that's the way it goes. And more Cosmic Fragments, dude. This game, <laughs> it pisses me off so much sometimes. Well, guys, I hope you had a much better opening after your season. We placed third, which I'm extremely happy about, but the reward's terrible. Terrible. I don't think it could have gone any worse, honestly. Like, like no help. I can't do a single thing. Didn't get a single champion that I wanted to rank up. Didn't get a single resource that's going to help me rank up a champion. <laughs> Just nothing. It's great. Well, that's going to do it. Um, I'm going to go to bed now because it's 4 in the morning. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, drop a like. The rest of the war season will be posted soon. Still got a few more wars. Uh, and the last one's really, really sick. Sasquatch boss fight. You're not going to want to miss that one. But yeah, that's going to do it. Thanks for watching. Peace out.